Well, I made some progress this weekend. I got the um, Super 2100 finished with the long bar on it. This was in pretty rough shape cosmetically. There was things I couldn't do with it. Um, I did the best I could. I sanded it down. What somebody did was, first of all, they didn't clean it or take it apart completely. And they uh, sprayed it with some kind of thick, I want to say epoxy-like primer. And I mean it was thick. And then they put a paint over top of it. Well, the paint didn't bond to the epoxy well, so it was peeling and chipping in places. But once I got down, it was so hard to remove the epoxy. It just took so long. Well, for hand, hand sanding it anyway. Um, but um, it isn't bad. Um, it, it came out okay. Uh, it's a great saw. It's a big saw. It's running a 404 uh, by 63 chain on a 43, I think, bar, period bar. I had to make that little piece down there. When they painted it, restored it last time, they they'd even painted the, the on-off switch and some of the knobs. Um, so, anyway, I've got it. Uh, where I want it now. I've been fighting this um, XL400 for several weeks now. I couldn't get any spark to it. And I found out my problem. When I soldered the wire onto this tab, the wire was a tad short and I got a lot of solder on it, but no, the wire wasn't attached to the solder or the tab. After soldering it to the tab, we have spark. So this is going to go uh, do a little test and and uh, back on the shelf until I get a restore in, in, in line for a res restoration. So one more little uh, super mini VI I'm working on. Had some had a broken bolt that the machinist was supposed to fix a month ago. So I'm gonna go pick it up and fix it myself if he hadn't fixed it. And then I'll start going through saw after saw and. Uh, See what I need to do. I believe this VI-130 needs crank seals. Uh, the rest of them, I think, are all runners. I've tested in runners. I don't think I have any uh, non-runners up here either. Um, I don't know if anybody noticed, but that this is a U.S.-made uh, home light. And that one that's on the bench is a Canadian one and I don't know if it was just Canadian or the later year that they uh, put a rubber handle on the last year or the only, one, the only two years made there's a big 1050 I've got um, an 1130G restored in the house along with the 750 um, so um yeah, I'm going to keep going. I've got a garden tractor, an old garden tractor. I need to, an old Boland's garden tractor, 1556, that I started years ago that I never got finished. So I'll uh, I'll uh, get back on that next. Uh, but uh, just so many projects.